All right, here's four things she definitely wants you to do in bed tonight. These are the keys to good SEX that she might not be telling you she might have, or you just might not be listening. So guys, listen up. It is a known fact for women that SEX is emotional. Whether or not you have heard that in your brain, I'm laying it all out there on the line here on TikTok. So if you want to ensure that you're spending more time underneath the sheets, this TikTok's for you. Number one, good SEX starts before you get naked. Now, while most men have figured out that good one, two, three, four play is the key to a killer O, what you might not have figured out is that good arousal is based upon good communication, feeling admired, being flirted with, being teased. That's what needs to happen long before the clothes even up, end up on the floor and you start rubbing the old 8 to 12,000 nerve endings, okay? And if you're like, really? We've been together forever? That needs to continue happening. And if you're like, um, I want to feel loved too, we are aware. But I'm going to go back to this. SEX is more emotional for women than it is for men. We're going to call this for her mental lubrication. Just like men tend to enjoy a little bit more like a visual things. Think like corn or like, you know, you're scrolling Instagram and you tend to like stop at like, like the bikini boobs and you like they're bouncing. Okay. That's like your visual lusurcation. Women need mental lusurcation. Arousal for a woman is going to start long before, even before she's consciously aware of what's happening. Number two, good SEX is going to involve kissing. It may have been forever since you actually just made out with your partner, but I challenge you to just make out with them. Pick them up, make out with them and put them down. It is such a gesture of one, two, three, four play that you probably might not even understand. It is passionate. It unlocks a place in a woman's soul that cannot even be unmatched by anything. Think of it like that first kiss that you try to nail, like with your partner, nail it again. Good SEX involves communication. Just like you probably have learned that not all women like the same things in the bedroom, not all women are gonna communicate the same. We want a partner who is willing to pay attention to all of our verbal and nonverbal cues. I know y'all can see a deer from 200 yards out, but you can't see the, the ketchup behind the mustard. Pay attention in the bedroom. As if you were hunting or watching a fly ball or doing whatever you do that is like interesting to you. Because I know you are all interested in things that go on in the bedroom. Because when you are able to notice and then respond to the feedback that she is giving you, whether it's verbal or nonverbal, then number four, Good SEX is playful, okay? It's not just the same thing over and over again. It's not monotonous. It is new. It is exciting. It brings things into the bedroom. It leaves the bedroom. It is flirtatious, okay? You're going to try new things. You're going to try a new tingly cream. You're going to try a vibrator. That is what's going to keep the passion and desire growing. Talk to her about what feels good. Talk to her about things she wants to try and be open and willing. Any more tips, ladies?